Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Tableau Tips and Tricks. Today I'm going to show you guys how to build some fun what-if analysis using parameters in under four minutes. So here we start with our basic data set. I'm going to bring it into Tableau. I'm going to show my column grand totals. Here we go. Here we go. So what I want to do is allow the user to change the income so that we could see the calculations change. First thing is I'll create a parameter called income. This will be an integer. I'll press OK. Here we go. If I show parameter, here we have it. If I put a thousand, it's not doing anything. That is because we have to attach the parameter to an actual value. So I'll create a calculated field. It is going to be called replacement values. Very simple. If type equals income, then income. All right, else, let me get the value, end. Very simple calculation. So what I'm going to do is bring the replacement values to here, and then bring my value to here. And what you'll see once I do this is, boom, here we go. So we have, I'll make this shorter. We have our values, which are being shown on the right side, and then our replacement values, which are the same, but you'll notice that 2,000 right here could be edited. So 1,500. If we actually display the totals, you'll see that they are being changed. Instead of having 900, if you have a smaller income, let's say 600, you'll notice that now you have no income left over at the end of the month. So there you have it. That's a very simple to use these parameters. I'll show you an example of a workbook I've used with this technology before. As you can see right here, we have a big investment dashboard. If you change the cost of goods sold, let's say to 4,000, something ridiculous, you'll see that our charts will dynamically change. It'll show our allocations have changed, our OPEX has changed. So it's definitely a very fun hack, uh, very simple to do. So go ahead and let me know if you guys have any other questions. Otherwise, have a great day.